from basketball, we move to football. If you were in downtown Detroit this morning, you probably saw a helicopter flying over Ford Field. Today, work began to restore the building's roof. Our Paula Tutman went up in Sky 4 to see the work for herself. Karen, I know a lot of fans have been talking about a retractable roof, but when I talk to the Lions organization, they say, you know what, it really would not be cost effective. It would cost millions, and they'd really only use it a couple times a year. But when you really look at the roof from this perspective, you really get it. Now, you might not think a roof job is pretty sexy, but from 1,500 feet, take a look at this. It really is. The noise and spectacle could be seen for blocks. Is it a medical emergency, border patrol, a VIP? It has to have people talking on the street. The fact of the matter is, Ford Field needs a roof restoration. The roof is 12 years old and is showing signs of age. And it just so happens that the most cost-effective way to move roofing materials from the ground to the surface of the roof is by chopper. And the best way for us to show you this well-choreographed dance is by chopper. So it's all the product that's required, all the materials required that it's going to be to do this project. So the logo will get replaced as well on the roof. Mm -hmm. No more leaks in the roof areas anymore. So hopefully uh, the fan experience will be better on that aspect of it. The new roof will even make the stadium greener and more energy efficient. We're also going to get better reflectivity from the sun. So the heat load will be less on the roof as well. We applied for DTE energy credits, which uh, they're very happy to give us. Now we're uh, restoring it. We're going to give it additional service life that will extend 20 plus years. From a loft, you can see how intricate the operation is. 160 chopper lifts of materials, men below securing the pallets. From a loft, you can see how quickly and efficiently they move. And this is the safest way to move these materials. But imagine this. As the roof is being restored, these workers will have what has to be one of the coolest office views in the city right now, a top Ford field. So this is the first phase of the project. It's actually a three-month project, and I know people are going to be concerned about concerts like Beyonce and Guns N' Roses, but no worries. Those concerts go on. You won't even notice. I think the big thing is by pregame, this is going to be a great experience, not only for the stadium, uh, and not only great for energy, but obviously the most important thing is going to be a great experience for the fans. From 1,500 feet above Ford Field and the city of Detroit, Paula Tupman, Local 4.